the rank of four star general, flew 180 combat missions over Korea and Vietnam. Second row center, Titus Mark was scribed in gold with a star in the middle, Admiral Richard Evelyn Bird. He was the first to navigate the North and South Poles. Now, World War II was fought in just about every corner of the world, and Americans were given the chance to bring their loved ones buried overseas back home to native soil. This process is called repatriation. And over to our left is a World War II repatriation site, just as far as the eye can see. And the carnage seems unsettling. Let's take comfort in the fact that they're home at last, and at peace at last. A grateful nation will always remember. Now if you look to the right, ahead of this tram as we turn up on the hill, we'll be coming to three tall mountains. Hill, in honor of men who went onto the battlefield without any weapons to give spiritual comfort to others. Chaplain's Hill, here to the right now. At the tomb, you will see the guard on post walk 21 steps, pause 21 seconds to look at the tomb, and continue for 20.